All right, we should be live. Should be capturing the other display. Why is it capturing this display? Uh, add display capture. Create new main. Um, main screen. There you go. So we should have. Hmm. Interesting. Hold on. Let's add another display capture. Second screen for this display. Now they don't, they both show. Why is it doing that? I remove this, right? Uh, display capture. Can I do display two? Okay, now it now it goes between them. Great. So we want the game, which is game capture. There we go. Today. We are building the slime farm. I have uh, my thing right here. I have my tutorial right here, and we are going to go towards the swamp. Let's just let like, some chunks load. Anyways, uh, overnight I've uh, AFK'd in the mob spawner. Uh, I've gotten a bunch of levels. I've also organized everything. I don't think I've done this on stream, so I'll show you. Um, you got all the slabs, you got all the concrete. I went out, I don't know if that was on stream or not, but I went out and I uh, dug up a lot of gravel, dug up a lot of sand. I should have, uh, this one has a lot more gravel in it, a lot more sand. And I made a bunch of white concrete as the base block and the rest is deep slates. You also have all this uh, powder. I, I believe this was on stream. Or at least I did show it to you. And I have the deep slate stuff. I have the mushroom stuff. The soul campfire. The glass. Pretty much everything I need. So this stuff should be enough for uh, building it. And also, I enabled this option, where is it? This one, directional audio, which, uh, except for, you know, below and above, it gives me a really good indication as to where sound is coming from now in my headset. So I have IQ enabled. So I should have uh, different equalizer settings. So yeah, everything should be nice and dandy. I think the swamp is that direction. Um, towards my slime chunk so I believe we're gonna go out and start building these are all uh, temporary blocks so I have all this food here so that shouldn't be an issue yeah there's the swamp I'm gonna find an area that I like for building the farm in it should be 33 by 33 it should have uh, a lot of space. Maybe this one right here? Nah, this one, this one, this one. Okay, so. so, we're gonna try and use, okay. So, let's see. Let's put this in here. So I believe it is 33 one campfire by 33. Or sold campfire. Right. Yeah. But it's not a list, but something you should also get, put Let's uh, make sure. Instead. Okay, so let's start building this. You might need to chop down some trees that are in the way. So I marked out a 33 by 33 area. Yeah. Chop down it. So 33 by 33. So 
let's start it like I guess um let's let's look at this for a second from the top see where the best spot to make it in I think right here should be the best spot like let's see there's a lot of uh, clearance in that direction and a lot of clearance in every direction so I'm gonna mark out this is the three blocks and then so that's one two that's 33 so we need to go to y equals 36 I believe right here on the same x coordinates so. um, I want to say this is 33 by 33 but I'm not sure how he calculated it exactly cuz eh, whatever if it's wrong it's wrong so now I need to go uh, to negative 1800 79 is that right or 59 I believe that's right right let's just uh, make sure minus uh, 33 95 minus 33 is 1928 oh, what oh 62 I made a wrong calculation. I made 36 because it was block 36. So we need to go to, what was it? 1862. We'll go there right now. 62, right here. And right here. That, that should be that. And there we go. And now we just, Swim in that direction, keeping the 62 over to y equals 3 right here. Yeah, and that's uh, 33 by 33 area. So we got that. So, next on the agenda is the trees on the weird side. Okay, so let's start building. I made a little platform here at the center and storage is up to you. So I'm just going to place down one chest. But storage is up to me. I'm going to make a, a lot more storage than he will. So I need to get to the center, which I have no idea how to uh, figure out what the center is. I'm just guessing, I guess. God, I hate I hate this stuff. I hate how Minecraft works like that. Um, what's this center between 30, 33 blocks? Let's just mark it out. One, two, three, four. Also, I'll make sure it's 30. So one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll stop at 16. Uh, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And then I'm going to go here. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. It's two blocks in the center. So it's a two block center. And he has a one block center. So what's uh what's up bro? Did I do it wrong? So this is one, two, three, four, five. Six. Wait, that doesn't make sense that it'll be two blocks. Okay, so I think this is what I should do. And then this and then this and also that direction I should also cut it down by one god I hate calculations and coordinates in Minecraft like I made a 33 by 33 area. how how did you make the 33 by 33 area like starting at what block 
This one, I also need to take it back one. Yeah. Uh, and this one, just keep it that way, but take it one here, right? And now that should be a... It's not that the elytra is going to activate because it says wants to work. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16. This doesn't look like 16 blocks, but we're not. Uh, actually, I made two extra. That's one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. That should be good. Alright. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Alright. So now that's the 33 by 33 area that he meant. So that should meet. Ah. Okay, so this is the center right here. These are the three center pieces. Now I can delete all this shit I did. Let's also make sure that there's no spawning on that. Or here, else don't want spawning. All right, and we got just one more left. I hate this. I hate working like this. Alright. You have to hop. So, about this, I'm gonna make a bigger area, but I guess for now, until we see that it functions, I don't need to worry about this. A hopper and a chest. Hopper begins, so this is one necessary hopper. Alright, then put your campfire on top of that and then go out three blocks to each side. Alright, so we're gonna take some blocks. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we go. Like this, and fill in a platform. It's by the way really important that fill in a platform. So, what you say? That the hopper here is at the right height because the rest of oh god the farm. Depend on it. Um, so maybe double check relative to the water in the swamp biome. 
like two blocks above. But also you can open your F3 menu. Look at the hopper, targeted block 64. Oh my god. Targeted block 64. Oh my god, that's so lucky. Make sure you have that. I forgot okay, about so the it height. should look like this. Next we're gonna place a ring of blocks around, like that here. Gonna place down a fence gate on top of the campfire. Okay, so let's... Finish out the platform. Now let's get on top of it. Open it and <laughs> I actually need these right now. Um I think this should be a good place to put him in right now. So put a little ring around the edge. Closing sides. And then... Friends and then we can place down the powder snow buckets. So you can actually get away with only having nine. Um, but it's a little bit better if you have 25. Luckily, I have 25. So, on top of this. That's 25, right? All right. In case you're short on powder, snow for some reason, yeah, you can get away with this as well. By the way, as a version, you will use more campfires and more hoppers instead. Um, but I think powder snow shouldn't be too hard to get. So that's why I'm going to use that. I'm going to place four water sources in the corners. And that's this part. All right, so now the four water bottles. And I'm missing one in this corner. All right. Then uh, just go up two more blocks here and complete the walls. Alright, so it should look like this. Next step is putting in the iron golem. So we need a trapdoor for the iron golem to stand on. You can use a wooden... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Perfect, perfect. One, uh, one iron one. Disadvantage of the wooden one is that you can accidentally click it. Alright, um, then we're gonna place a fence around. Okay, so let's take out my fences and trapdoors. 
How do you do it? Alright. Uh, Vega, Vega. Um, I'm gonna disadvantage of the wooden one so you can aim. Accidentally click it. Alright, um, then we're gonna place a fence around. It's just like this. Then to summon in the iron golem. It's gonna go up a block, do it like that. And carve pumpkin. Alright. Alright, so we're gonna need to take you and go up a block. That. Like that and there we go. Okay, so next step is building the spawning platform. It's actually important now to use full blocks here so we can place the mushrooms on. And of course, instead of concrete, you can use stone blocks or just plain cobblestone or something like that. Okay, so we need to go out eight blocks for six, eight. Um, it's probably easiest if you do this. On like two sides like this, or six eight. Then you can bridge over like that and connect it. Okay, mm -hmm. so that's one way to get. get I'd it like right. the Xbox.
Okay, okay, I need to do it for help the other. my my uh, sisters. Corner as well. Got eight blocks. All right, so he's going eight blocks out. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. God, that is so horrendous. Stop doing that. too much because I started to enjoy the speed bridge okay uh, and then I guess fill it in have more right right so I don't think I need this anymore these buckets this lady I don't really need um We're almost done. And <laughs> that guy looks like a bed.
Just a couple more blocks to fill in. I wouldn't be surprised if I need to go pick up the blocks from under this, this place. There's like three blocks under. Ah, I need to go do that. I don't know exactly where they are, right there. Kidding me. All right, next up on the agenda. Got eight blocks here. Ones and more items. Slap. I can go out to smash this up with this corner. And so on, just make the, the whole platform. Okay, so the next step is to build this three wide slab platform around. Um, it's optional as I said, but I would definitely recommend to do it because you could just get more slime spawns and more items. Right, so just three wide all around. Okay, so next step is... Okay, so now we're gonna go to the things. We're gonna put all this in because we really don't have space all this stuff. Um, take out all the slabs. Get some more. And we're gonna take out one temporary lock. We're gonna put right here. And then This is going to take a, a while. So the only thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try... I'm going to try and speed rich right here. Place a ring of no, no, man. Okay, I need to go down here anyway because I'm gonna. Go. No, man, it slabs. Why do they keep doing this? So, right here. Oh wait, what if I just... Ah, oh, that's much easier. Right, and then we would go two out like that.
All right, and that's the whole ring. All right. Cool beans. What's next? Stairs around. The other option you can also use tinted glass if you prefer that. So now we got the stairs one block out. Gonna take a temporary block like so. And then just go around. See, that's that's what I didn't want to do. Also, that's not, not, not cool. Alright, so okay. Do not sell marijuana to my husband. Okay. I'm not sure these are enough stairs. Okay, these are enough stairs. That's enough slices. And then I'm assuming the tinted glass. Right, so it should look like this. And next you want to place either another layer of stairs on top, or if you have it, tinted glass. It is kind of nice because you can look inside from the outside. All right, so on top of the tinted glass, We're just gonna play some bottom slabs. They should look like this. Unfortunately, we can't place the brown mushrooms yet because you can't place them in light level 15 or skylight level. Okay, so now. So 13 or lower is fine. So we're just gonna place the roof on top. So technically you can also use pot soil or mycelium here and place them on it already. But then some people might have the downside if they wouldn't have the area flooded below that an enderman could grab the pot soil block or something like that. Um, that is why I decided to just use normal stone or concrete blocks instead. Just gonna place the roof first and then place the mushrooms, which is also fine. More downside. Need to place down a couple of light sources here and there to not get attacked by hostile mobs. Okay, but anyway, so just gonna place um, a full roof of slabs. And in the center, you won't be able to place the slabs because there's the iron golem. There we just go up a block. Um, so around here, can't place any.
this is probably gonna take a while. What?
from the corner here we got it one two three four five blocks from the corner here we got it one two three four five blocks one two three four five do that for all four corners one, two, three, four, this way the five. whole platform one, will two, be lit three, up four, and normal hostel spawning will be one, two, prevented three, four, no zombies five. creepers etc okay then next we go back inside of the, the farm might to break a block or something like that and we can start with the mushroom placing Okay, so you shouldn't have huge issues with those mob spawning while placing down the mushrooms. But if maybe even the slimes harass you a little bit, it's also okay to maybe place down a torch in the middle. To light it up at least partially, uh, you can still place it at light level 12 or lower. Okay, um, you can also leave out some spots. So technically, you already have the campfire. So in those four spots, you don't need to place down mushrooms, but it might be... Light level two.
simpler just to place them anywhere. Alright, so fill it up entirely with mushrooms. Okay, so next we wanna add the AFK spot. So we wanna go up to 192. I think the easiest way is if we place another slab here and then scaffolding on top. Uh, just get 120 scaffolding exactly and click it all down. Alright, so. then scaffolding. The easiest way is if we place another slab here and then scaffolding on top. Uh, just get 120 scaffolding exactly and click it all down. Alright, so if you're up here the targeted block would be 192. By the way, there's a little bit of leeway, but I'd rather have that uh, than people building it up one block too high <laughs> and then not getting any spawns. Okay, so you can technically go up two blocks higher, but this is also fine. So if you want, you can go out maybe one more block around to a bit more safe up here. So maybe place a torch to not get any mobs spawning. Then of course you have the phantom issue. Um, just place down maybe a slab up here. If you stand below, you don't get any phantom spawning. You can also wall yourself in if you want to, just to be absolutely sure. Alright, just FYI, in case you don't know it, you don't want to build a huge platform directly above the farm because it would directly affect the spawn rates of the slimes. So if you can, don't build anything above besides the little AFK platform, so don't move your storage up here. Uh, it might be convenient, but yeah, it's definitely detrimental for the spawning rates and the items you get down. Alright, so we're done with building. Got another account here standing at the top right now, and as you can see, the farm is already producing a bunch of items. Pretty good. A lot of slime in there already. Also, check the chests. Yep, good. It's pretty good. All right. So I hope you could follow the tutorial, and the farm is working for you. By the way, it is probably going to be one of the last tutorials I make on this channel. My plan is actually to start another channel that will focus solely on tutorials. We'll have another style, a bit more video editing and so on, just to make sure that there's no reason to get tutorials from the Content Thief channels instead. Alright, that's it for today. Thanks guys for watching and see you next time. Bye bye! Okay, so the farm should be in working order now. I will fly up there to AFK for like five minutes. Just to make sure.
Oh wait, it's a new moon. There's gonna be no slimes. So instead of that, what I'm gonna do is make a bit of a better storage system. Like that. Let's see. Go. Chest, chest, chest. That's just for now. Okay, and my house is, I'll leave that direction right there, maybe. I'm gonna go sleep this night off. Yes. Yes. So we got wood items, chests, drops. That's it. Let's uh, sleep this night off. Cause I'm not gonna get any slimes tonight. It's a new moon. Oh, there's a crescent moon.
it. Does it matter what the render distance is? I don't know, I don't know if it does. The simulation distance, whatever. So I'm gonna go to FK here for like five minutes. I'm gonna watch some TikTok. Hopefully. It's not funny.
people keep playing with me like I'm really like you feel me? <laughs> like uh, my people keep playing with me like I'm really like I think we can all agree that Shorty is a little unhinged, but damn. Kashawn Rock got on Kai, whatever the fuck his last name is, Twitch, and showed her ass. Shorty was on here tossing midgets. She put a hole in this nigga's wall, like, bro. If there was anybody in the world who, like, gave off hot Cheetos in the morning type vibes, it's definitely her. She treat this nigga like a substitute teacher. Just, it just makes you think, you know, how fire is the pussy? Because, <laughs> because he's crazy, and I, and I know there's a direct correlation. How fire is it? Y'all, let me know. You think? What y'all do? Arnie, stop chewing on the line. Hi, hi, Gilbert. <laughs> Gilbert, I told you. Your brother can't keep batting through utility lines. He won't, Jerry. I promise. <laughs> Arnie, stop playing with the curtain. Don't you yell at him, Gilbert. He's your brother. You have to take care of your brother. Yeah, Gilbert. You have to take care of your brother. <sighs> I'm coming, Mama. <laughs> mm. Oh, Arnie, you're my knight in shimmering armor. Mm. Mm. Oh. <sighs> Mama, there's a storm coming, Mama. <laughs> Ooh, scary. Scary storms up there, Mama. <laughs> Mama, Mama, you're hiding from me, huh? Mom was hiding from Arnie. I know that. <laughs> Mama? said it would be a miracle if Arnie lived past a year and a half. Well, he just turned two. Mom is gone, and so is the treehouse. But we can go anywhere. Come on, Gilbert! <laughs> we can all right, I'm just going to do a quick check. Oh, I hear slimes. I hear a lot of slimes. I feel a lot of slime balls. It's working. Thank you, Il Mango, for this insane design. Sucks that I, uh... That I dug out that whole chunk. <laughs> or nothing. Uh, but that's cool, that's cool. You know, you learn from your mistakes. gonna be a crescent moon today and honestly I don't really need to skate right now at the at this farm I kind of need to go home real quick 
But it's a full moon I'll come in AFK. So, what I want to do right now is I want to extend my villager uh, trading hall. Now I can do that. Uh, but first, I need to build a ton of pistons. And that requires a decent amount of iron, which I have as much as I could ever possibly need. And a decent amount of cobble, which I also have as much as I could ever possibly need. And what is that? Wood? Wood, which I have slightly less of. But, let's see. Uh, I need to make a, a wood farm, is what I need to do. Alright, let's make that. And let's make some of that. And now let's make as many pistons as I can. Uh, I can't really see the pi Oh, I need redstone. Redstone. Probably have way too much iron. Um, piston. Like that. And then make more redstone. Make more pistons. Make more pistons. Make more. Right. I'm missing some cobblestone now. Oh, can I use deep slate to make these? Um. So it's like this, and then like uh, I forgot how to make. Uh, I don't think I can use deep slate for this. So uh, let's get some normal cobblestone. Make more. Now my bottleneck is wood, which is uh, it's fine. Let's make the rest out two iron blocks. There you go. All right, now I got a bunch of slime balls. So I'm just gonna put this here because it's green. Wood planks, and I got all the slime balls that I could need ever. I could actually make these into slime blocks, and then put them like that. All right. So now, what we need for making more is as follows. I actually want to place a roof on top of this first. Um, like it shouldn't be like a complicated roof. Just like, just gonna make like a one color roof. Still making bebes. You guys love each other. This is a really good design. I, I've had a lot of trouble with previous designs that I've tried to make. Like in 114, I had a world and I tried to make a villager breeder like this one. But instead of the beds going like this, they were going like around a little fence gate thing. A little fence thing and the villager would slip or something. I don't know. Um, yeah, it didn't work quite well, but now it works. Iron Farm is producing at all times. I wish I could make this slime farm here around my base like I envisioned it to be. But, mm, it's whatever. Uh, so I can make this pretty long. Which I probably will. And I'll probably have, uh... 
something else with villagers. I don't know what else you could do with villagers. At the back of this, like right here. But I'll see what else I can do with villagers. In the meantime, I need to cover it up. And the block I will use to cover it up is going to be... Can I make black dye? How do you make black dye? Black, black terracotta with... How do you make black dye? Oh. With ink sinks. So... I'm gonna go hunting for some ink. There you go. I have a looting sword, it should be pretty good. I knew it was ink sacks, but I thought maybe there was like a different way because ink sacks is not very efficient. Though I might make an ink farm sometime because I can also trade it with villagers for emeralds. Uh, I'm not seeing any... Not seeing enough movement! There you go. It's me, I'm your uh... I'm your um, fate coming to meet ya. Right, I'm 26. That's not nearly enough. Actually, wait. No, it is. It is enough. Cause I got more at home, and it makes like 16 blocks per. Uh. Also, I need to make. A couple of uh, uh, farms for like automating this process here, like the melon farm and pumpkin farm. I can do that, and I can make sugarcane farms. So I need to do those. But we'll get to that bridge when we get to it. So I need four stacks for it. That's perfect. Actually, wait, no, it's not perfect. Black dye and black concrete powder. There we go. Uh, put that back in. Put that thing back wherever it came from. Or oh, so help me. So help me. Okay. So the way I uh, make concrete, I'll do a little staircase right here for uh, a little area to make concrete in. I'll make it look nice as well. Let's get some haste effects. I'm speaking, so it's a bit easier to get the stone out of the way. I'm just gonna cover it up with like whatever. And then just dig a build area. Dig a build area. Dig a dig a build area. Okay. All right. That's roughly what I want it to be. And then eventually I'll put in like uh, concrete at these stations. Um, let's, let's look best way to convert concrete powder. A fast technique. Power up. Powering up. That's definitely not the fastest way. 
fifty per second. This is what I want, though, for now. How does it work? Drop rib surface stare. Let's just see how it works. If it's worth looking into. Operating is the chest, okay. So far, I get your blood. That's the building blocks, okay. What does the dropper do? Oh, it gives you the powder. Ah, uh, I get it. Smart, that's smart. So let's uh, let's do that. So I should have an observer here. I should have a spruce staircase here. And I'm gonna make it with white concrete. I think I should have some. There we go, white concrete powder. And black concrete powder. Um, and I'm gonna use... We need some one hopper, two chests, like that. We need a sign, a water bucket we got. Uh, for now, let's, uh, let's, 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 let's uh, just convert this. And a few more of these. Just so I have them. I should have done this where I have the haste. Actually, it's not too late. Let's just cover this up and, and go over there. effect is available right here. Should I make it like an inside the mountain a little bit? Hey. You're not supposed to be there. Let's light this place up a bit more, I guess. Uh, 
I don't want mobs spawning here, really. This place is a safe haven. Alright, now let's see. Where can I make this concrete maker? If I make it in, into the mountain, but this direction, right? Actually, I should hit the haste, please. Yeah. Blocks down, dig a hole. Oops. Dig a hole. Like that set a temporary torch for now. That and then stay right there. And then let's do let's do white concrete along the bottom. And black concrete along the top. Um, you know, let's keep it functional first before I uh, decorate it because I'm, I'm using the blocks that I'm supposed to be having. Sign right there. And that. That's that. There we go. And then a dropper I didn't get. How do you make it? Easy enough. I had the cobblestone. I just need the redstone. Let's make it. And grab two pieces of redstone as well. So, is that a zombie? How did you get here? How did you get here? Um, so that and that is like that. That's like that. And that should be. Ready, right? And if I do, if I put it in here, right, and I go, yeah, it works. All right. So it gets transported over to the chest. Overall, it works, so that's good. So now let's make it nice and purdy. I'm gonna use all sorts of concrete, all sorts of dyed concrete. What kind of dyes do we have? So we're gonna get more white, less white. I can hear like a, a mob. And get your ass. Um, what other types of dye do I have? Um, I got flowers, right? I got corn flowers and dandelions. I should make dyes. Blue dyes and yellow dyes. And let's get some sand and gravel out and make. Ooh, should I make light blue? Yeah, okay. Let's make some light blue dye. 
And let's make some yellow. There we go, that's nice. Alright. I'm gonna make these. I'm actually gonna keep a couple. needed white but I guess that's actually let's get some white yeah I know I know Types of concrete. So we got this, 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 and we got this, and we got this, and this. So, first things first, let's get temporary blocks. Let's get rid of you and the walls around here. And I like the idea of having some gravel and sand on the wall as well. So I'll do that. And uh, let's go to suck touch. A torch there, make sure it comes in. So, we're gonna start out with some gravel and some sand. Let's go get some sand. I should have some outside the. There we go. So, gravel and sand. That's. That's good, and then some dirt. There you go. Okay, I can't forget the ceiling too. So, let's start from here. Do some mm. All right, and we got some sand around it. And now I'm gonna place some white concrete powder. some yellow concrete powder along with some Nice. 
Okay, and also... I need more. I need more uh, of these. Oh, can you get them? Of course, we can also play around with the grass with the bottom. Perfect. And that's the entire build, I think. How are you going to cover that up? I'm going to put torches on either side of this, like it's a feature. Let's make all these into powder. Into concrete. Oh, that's not good.
that everything? Oh, the crafter feather? I guess, I guess that's enough, yeah. What, what type of moon is it today? Almost full moon. When it's a full moon, I go away if get slime farmed for the night. And I'm gonna also take the end rods because they're gonna go really, they're gonna look really good on top of this. Cause they have a there's a problem of uh, villagers maybe getting struck by lightning, turning into witches. We don't want that. That dog is gonna get adopted by me. I'll adopt you. Don't worry about it. And that's technically all I need for for them, but I'll I'll make it look nicer by yeah, black concrete has almost you cannot you almost cannot distinguish between yeah just so it, it looks nicer I'll give it like a I'll work to the edge. God damn it. Dog is still here. What am I gonna call him? You're talking about what is he doing right now? How is he doing this? All right, some end rods. I'll make him like actually useful. And then the sooner, uh, soon enough, we'll connect him. How does it look? Actually, it looks great. Right now, here, I want to have another little spot above their head where they cannot be, they cannot be hit. This way the zombie villagers also won't burn. Hey guys. Good day today, huh?
Okay. So, right now, what needs to happen is I need to expand. And the way to expand it. It's your thing, not above your head. I don't know why it was like that. But anyway, the first thing we need to do in order to expand is to count. How much we need to remove all this also. All this needs to go. You guys talk too much. Uh, I'm gonna do that later. So we need a lot of observers. Part of these and some of these. I already have a lot of observers, but you know, I can't hurt him anymore. Um, uh, let's see what else. What kinds of materials did I use? So. It looks like I used spruce planks. Spruce plank, what, for that, not for that thing. Sorry. Gotta do a little stretch. Okay. So it looks like. Uh, what is this? Quartz? Why do they use quartz, man? Stupid me. Anyways. It looks like quartz. Uh, these slabs. Lovers, pistons, all the shenanigans. So, let's see how it works in the back. I should have two, two pistons each. All right, let's first start by getting shears to get rid of all that wood. Cause I got a lot of wood there. Um, I took the shears yeah, and I put them back. So yeah, let's uh, clear it up a little bit for expansion. All right guys, good news, good news, good news. You're getting uh, more neighbors. Whatever you had, you're gonna have double. But not right now, because right now is sleeping time. Okay, so it seems like his thing is glass all around. Mm, it's not quite sleeping thing yet. So, they need more bricks on the bottom. Let's just, uh, let's do the bottom. Bottom is easy enough. So that is one, two, three, four, five more stations. Exactly how much they're standing on top of. Is that a full block or is half block? 
think it's a full block. But we'll get to that bridge. Um, do I have redstone on me? Or no, I do not. Well, I mean, I need to fly to the... To the thing, so I'm gonna put uh, my blocks right now. What the, what? I'm gonna get a little shulker box, actually. I'm just gonna put everything in there, and I'll sort it out later. You, however, you need to go into the uh, into the oven. All right, let's do this little repair my pickaxe. My axe, my shovels, a lot of stuff that needs to be repaired. Gold, full moon tonight. We're going, we're going. No, I know we're going. <laughs> Where'd I put my others? Okay, there. All right, we're going, we're going, ow. Need to go high. Because my AFK spot is high. All right guys, so I'm gonna AFK the knight. Right here under this block. And yeah. So, I'm going to go eat, I, th I think. Actually, maybe I won't go eat. Because if I have K here too long, I'm scared that eventually, what, what she, what's your call? Um, phantoms are going to spawn, even though. So, you know what? To counteract that. I have an idea. Whoa, that was unnecessarily close. Let's just put some blocks to, to cover me up. Because I'm a big scaredy cat. Like that. Like that, like that, and like that. And now uh, I'm fully covered. And now I can go eat. So I'll start streaming again later. Uh, yeah, I've been live for how long? That is a 